All right, we've, we've had lots of singing, so I'm going to go to a story now. I'm going to tell you the story of my first Penzik Woods band. No shite, there I was. <laughs> this was when I was serving the barony of Bacail, and I was in the mighty army of Bacail with 36 members. It was incredible. And we went into the woods, and I was a pole armsman who fought on the left flank, meaning I'm the dead man. <laughs> My job was to slow down the opponents long enough for the rest of the line to escape. But there I was, in the woods, ready to go. Except all of the army that was allied with us was on one side of the center of the woods, and Mikhail were all alone on the other. A single line thick. And our opponents in the mid round looked at us and went, <laughs> easy me. <laughs> and they started coming at us and they hit us again and again and again. And we fought and we fought. And my, my dear friend Sabine, who is this tall and who was a spear woman, was shooting shots up under the shield wall into the oncoming opponents. And we, we, were, we were fighting and fighting and fighting and fighting, but we were getting so tired. Every time one of us fell, we ran back to the rest point and ran back to the line. But we were exhausted, and that's when our Baron stepped back 20 feet behind the line, took off his helmet, and sat down under a tree. And there wasn't a single one of us that were going to let somebody through the line to declare our Baron dead. So we fought hard. And the mid-realm decided, hey, maybe we should go over there where there aren't the crazy people. <laughs> and they began to attack the other side of the line, and that was fine. We go, <laughs> and our baron, bless him, put his helmet back on and said, all right, we have two of the flags. There's only one left. I know where it is. Follow me. And took off. And we followed him in a column of two, running, running, running. And from the front of the line, I hear, hey, you damn fool, get out of the way. And suddenly I was running over somebody. <laughs> I was in the back of the line, so I was kind of the last over. And I noticed it, it, it was King Timothy of the East. <laughs> he had apparently knelt down to tie his shoe. <laughs> and we went right over him. <laughs> But I wasn't going to stop. <laughs> I was already in trouble with him anyway. <laughs> Different story. <laughs> but then, so we charge, and there we see it, the last flight, right ahead. There are 36 of us and like 10 mid -rowers. We got this! We charge and And that's when the two columns of 20 hit us from the sides. <laughs> There was a flurry of blows, and then hold, hold, dead out, dead out. I alone was standing. <laughs> One of my comrades was legged beside me, and we are surrounded on all sides by unsympathetic looking mid-rollers. <laughs> and one of them leaned towards me and said, having fun. <laughs> That for the next few seconds I am. <laughs> At which point, Leon was called, I swung, swung, and then was clubbed like a baby harp seat. <laughs> and that is the story of my first woods battle. <laughs>